guys welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome to my channel for the first time this is not the video that I wanted to be sharing this week but unfortunately it is David and I are supposed to be in Iceland right now with EF ultimate break we have been looking forward to this trip for a long 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 time we were completely packed completely ready stuff was in our bag by the door ready to go as you know you need to have negative COVID tests before you travel anywhere um, our rapid tests both came back negative but unfortunately David's PCR test came back positive so if you are new here this is not new for us. Uh, I got quarantined in Jamaica when my test came back positive trying to get back into the States, so I know the situation could be a lot worse, but long story short, our trip to Iceland has been canceled. I am pretty sad about it. I will not um, lie about that. I'm very sad. I'm mourning the loss of this trip that we've spent so much time uh, looking forward to preparing for thinking about. I had already gone through and filmed an entire like what I'm packing and bringing and uh, everything like that like a video for you guys I actually have it all filmed edited uploaded to my channel ready to go out it was supposed to go out this weekend and it's not um you guys are getting this instead I did post on Instagram to see if you guys wanted to still see that video um, if it could still help anyone I had a lot of people say yes but I'm nervous to put it out because in the video I kept saying things like oh yeah subscribe to my channel because next week we'll have our content in Iceland and I can tell you like if we really needed this stuff or if I packed it and just had extra or if I would have changed this or this or this or this or this or whatever so I don't know if I want to post it and put it out there just because I know how the internet works. We did get some snow yesterday, so we did use like our new coats and boots and stuff. So I can say that I like really like all that stuff, but just not for like everything. So if you guys want to see that, let me know down below. Like I think I'll post it. I'm just like not 100% convinced. But yeah, I just wanted to come on here and tell you guys that the trip was canceled because I know I've been like talking about it a lot and saying that I'm super excited for it and it's just not happening in like it's not the worst news ever like it would be worse if either of us were stuck there we're stuck at home now we are together we have our dog um you know we have our own food we've done grocery pickup like we're not as limited as i was when i was uh quarantined in jamaica so like both of us know that this could be like a whole lot worse but we're like just sad about it like i laid in bed the other day all day i got out of bed to eat and go to the bathroom and that was it i laid in bed all day I did get some work done on my website I read a book but like I literally just like laid there and that is not like me at all like I'm a get up and do stuff and move around person and I didn't do any of that so we're just mourning the loss of our trip in the memories I will say working with EF it's so much easier than working with sandals um, EF has been like so accommodating to everything and like so helpful with like changing things I messaged them and I said hey look my husband tested positive for COVID we can't go obviously I'm not going to go without him I posted on TikTok and someone was like he left you in Jamaica just leave him in America and I was like that is funny and I totally like would not mind still going but I'm not gonna leave him um especially because now I've been like exposed or whatever um but here's the thing here's what I want to say this video is gonna be all over the place but I feel like I just need to like get it out and talk a lot of our Christmas plans were canceled because people had COVID and they knew it so they just canceled and like that's great um we went to one lunch and someone there ended up testing positive for COVID five days later and so we tested David got super super sick and we tested we were both negative we thought he had the flu but he was just like you know fever chills body aches all that like very COVID symptoms but also very flu like symptoms um and so we both tested negative and so we were like okay well he doesn't have it we still quarantined we planned on once uh you know we were in the window of like going on our trip we were going to stay at home and quarantine but we were like okay all covid tests came back in negative but if they come back like negative now like we're not going to get it obviously until then because this is what has symptoms and all that and like it just ugh, i don't know i don't know how he got it we were like literally home so long the only thing i can think of is that when we tested even though he had flu like covid like symptoms or whatever that it was like done wrong there was an error in the test or something and then he had it 
and then like I literally was not alone around him. He quarantined. I brought him meals up to the room. I was not around him. I didn't see him at all. Our big worry during that time was that he had a like false negative and then if we were still around each other I would get it and I would test positive before Iceland but I think he might just like because he's fine right now. No symptoms feeling great. He's still working from home every day. This is just what I've convinced myself to make myself feel better about this whole situation. I think that that was a false test and he should have tested positive that day and I think that he's just still testing positive now. You know because people can test positive for up to like 90 days, 3 months, whatever. But I'm pretty sure that that is like what happened and that's why we can't go. So he is completely outside of his quarantine window from when he originally tested positive we did confirm it with an at-home test the test in the packing video that my cousin sent me we used one of those and boom it was positive we we're like great um <laughs> but we are outside of his like quarantine window anyway for how long it's been since he's had it like we have not left our house what is today we haven't left our house in like three weeks we've been here a lot we did go out yesterday in the snow and like take pictures self portraits in the snow but like that's not like going out and seeing people and doing stuff so like we've been like stuck in this house for a while we've been working on the basement we had um people drop stuff off supplies to keep like painting and stuff down there but it's just it's been a rough couple days weeks but we're hopeful we have a tour to eastern europe planned we're hopeful that it can all work out and that we'll be good to go then but we'll see our luck in traveling is just not it lately but I don't really have much else to say for this video. I had a couple people reach out and ask me to give an update on the current situation because they know people who are going through this too and it would just be good to just put out there. You know me, I just put everything out there. Um, but that is it for this video. Thank you for watching. Sorry it's not fun content of us being in Iceland exploring, seeing all the awesome stuff that's out there, but it is what it is. Better luck next time. There's a reason we are here. When I called my aunt and told her, she looked on the ground and there was a dime, which is, if you're not familiar with my channel, you know that that is, like, a sign from my mom. And so, like, we're supposed to be here and, like, that's, yeah. But that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching. Let me know if you want to see the packing video. Subscribe to my channel anyway. And I'll see you next time. Bye.